Hey guys, your host AMF1534 here, and let's play some more Resident Evil 2. Last time, we got ourselves a couple of things, um, of which I don't have either of them in my inventory right now. We got, we had ourselves the uh, unicorn medal, which we put into the fountain in the very opening room, and got ourselves the spade key, which we already used and got out of. We also put the two red jewels away, because we don't need them. And now, we're in the library. My absolute favorite room in this game. And now we have a small puzzle to figure out, so let's do that. Because we need to. Push that one this way. And that was it. So, um, we need to go back behind here. We'll pick up that thing. Will you take the bishop plug? Well, of course. Why not? Sounds like a good idea to me. Alright. Um, where are we gonna go? I got an idea. Let's go up here. Boop, 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 boop. What is in here? I always forget what's in here. What could possibly be in here? Oh, okay, yeah, we we can't go there yet. And you'll figure out exactly why in just a minute. We're going to need a certain little something before we go off and do anything like that. Of which, we need to go downstairs. Come on. Come on, let's go. Let's go through the big double doors, and we'll go to the second floor. I think that's where it is. It is the second floor. I always forget. Anywho. Oh, hey. God, I forget those guys are there every time. He says. Did he need to get back up? Was he really down for the count? He sure was. He couldn't handle it. And he won't be able to either. Man, both of those guys were just out quickly. They cannot handle my superior everything. We'll lower the emergency ladder to make our traversing between these two floors a little bit easier. It'll come in handy, I promise. Where is this guy? I know he's here somewhere. Hey, there he is. Let's see if I can get a quick one out. Yeah, there we go. God, I didn't think I was going to get that off in time. And we uh, definitely don't have very many bullets left for that. I really hope we pick some up later. I must say, this is quite the first day on the job for, for Mr. Leon. I would probably quit my duties as a police officer directly after this day was over. Because, I mean, let's be honest. Your first day on the job, you almost get run over by a semi, and you go to, you go to a police station full of zombies. Like, is it really worth it? Ooh, a small key. What are we gonna use that small key for? I got an idea. I accidentally moved one of the stone statues on the second floor when I leaned against it. Hey, we did that already. When the chief found out about it, he was furious. I swear the guy nearly bit my head off. Well, I'm glad he didn't. That'd be kind of fucked up. Literally worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. Another l large picture frame in his hands. It was a really disturbing painting depicting a nude person being hanged. Hey, we also dealt with that one too. That's where we got our first red jewel from. How's about it? Okay, so... Let's put the bishop plug away, and the red herbs, we don't need that either. Um, that'll do for now, though. Oh, I need to get my crank. That's what I need. Do we need anything else? No. No, we don't. Um, yeah, let's go up here first, I think. We'll go back... Do a little backtracking, because we do have one very short thing to do at the moment. 
Okay. Back to the library we go. I really hope energy... Energy. I really hope Leon has his energy drinks with him because we're going to do a lot of running. I apparently forgot how to... I've had... This has been like my entire day today. I've had problems talking properly and it's kind of weird. I was talking to customers today and I started slurring a little bit. It was kind of uncomfortable because I almost spit on him totally inadvertently, but it's just, uh, everything was just a jumble of crap today. That's what happens, though. That's When you work in retail during busy days, it's going to get like that. So, what do you do? What do you do? Anyways, now we're here, and we're going to be good to go. I feel like if I remember correctly, um... I think if it's in Claire's scenario, there's a liquor that's just kind of chilling right there waiting for you so we can bite your head off. But I could be wrong, though. I don't remember exactly when that happened. It seems to be broken. It won't work. Well, that's not very cool. A square hole? Well, goddammit, wrong button. Well, let's put this thing in there. Square hole equals crank. That's good. I don't know why you need that, but... You know, whatever. And now, that's the entire tenure of the crank in this game. Not very much. Kind of makes you wish it was around for longer. Some games even have more than one crank in it. It looks like there's a switch. Will you push it? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's definitely not going to work without the other cog in it. All that just for one small thing. That's all right, though. No biggie. No biggie at all. So basically, that was a small objective just to get something out of our inventory. Wasted time. You betcha. But now we can move on to something else. So that's, that's just, just excellent. Dun, dun, dun. Let's see. Did we go do that part yet? No, we totally didn't. Um, do I have that file? You guys are probably wondering what I'm talking about right now. I definitely have not done that yet. Oh my god. I am an idiot. Well, luckily for us, we lowered down that ladder. So, without further ado, let's go take care of that. I totally forgot about that room. I just totally like dismiss it because I always forget that you need the heart key to go a little bit further down there. But we're not going to deal with it. Hmm. Okay. Now. Let's go back downstairs. I seem to always forget something. And then you feel like a real jackass. Oh my god, go down the ladder quicker, for god's sakes. At least in Claire's scenario, she'd actually go down these things quicker, but, you know, whatever. It's not her fault. Or it's not his fault that he's slow. This part can be really, really bad if you don't have the uh, proper things to deal with it with. And by that, I mean... Lots and lots of weaponry. Oh. Say goodbye to your shotgun ammo, senor. Oh my god, I shot him in half! I totally shot that guy in half! Oh my god! Oh no! Oh my god, I can probably take him out now. After I reload. Is that litter? Oh no! Okay. Well, that was a very, very large waste of time. And a big waste of ammo. But that's okay. I've got a lot. I've got plenty. I'm not too worried about it. Hello! 
And now there's more. Oh, get around him, get around him. Take care of this guy. Go around, go around. There you go. A little bit more manageable when they're all the way over here. Jeez, it's a fucking lunger. And he missed. Makes him look like even more of a jackass. <laughs> uh oh, yeah. Yeah, now I'm running low on ammo. Now I feel like an idiot. God, get away from me. You guys are smart. No, you stay down. I feel like I'm talking to a fucking dog or something. Two, two, three, and six. That will get us some gr some shotgun shells. Awesome. And the police station map. Awesome. All right. Well, that'll at least you know give us a little bit of momentary relief. And there's a little something something down here too, which we need that right now because we're hurt. Okay. I have a text, I'm sorry. Okay, one more thing. Let's go in this back hallway back here. Hey, oh. Oh, that's right. This guy has something good for us. He has some bullets. Hey, look at One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Fucking tight. It's the sweetest, it's like the tightest thing I've ever seen in my life. And that's the room. That's the one, Mob. That's the one with the, uh... With the heart handle. Heart hole, not handle. God, I'm an idiot. This, one, this, I, this exactly this totally confirms what I was talking about earlier. I totally cannot talk. Ooh, let's take these bad boys. We'll take that green herb. And we'll take that green herb. Put them together, and what do you got? Another green herb. No, don't use it, don't use it. You don't need to use it. Let's see what happens if we go up here. There's another one. Excellent. Let's see. Combine it with the even better herb, and you get the awesome huge green herb. All sorts of weed for all your fun activities. Lock from inside. Well, now that we've got our nice little stash of weed and some healthy portions of shotgun shells, what are we going to do next? Well, I'll tell you what. Stick around for the next episode of Let's Play Resident Evil 2, and you'll find out. So this is your host, AMF1534, saying goodbye for now, and I'll see you guys in just a little while. See you later. Bye.